Hello and welcome back to NSR Riveting Action and Let's Play A Katana. Winner of three Emmys and nine gold blues. Five is another chilling game we will test your fortitude. I will leave Super Flea and the close at here for added safety. Right now I have some business to attend to and now is not the time for Sony Fan. First thing I have to turn some wheels up here's the hard part about this level is not much ammo and you have to use silver clock to see on serve a unicorn. Also hard jumps and have a trap. Well luckily this is the last part I'm gonna go in but it sure ends and memorable. Also, dungeon levels looks much like Quake 1 levels. Did you know they Katana originally being developed for Quake 1 engine? But eventually they moved to Quake 2 engine. Isn't that fascinating? I can easily kill these enemies here but you see my power level is very high. It is over 9000. But still be hard unless this is a darn tough level. Okay, this area is where a sort of boss battle happened. It's fairly easy, just don't fall in the lava. And leave Super Flea in his hidey hole. Honestly, viewer, I died many times the awkward in this level. But in the end, I win the day and the game is a foot. The real best thing lies because one more to go. Sequence complete. Well, actually, there are three wheels to run here, so let's not get ahead of ourselves. Now we are ready to fight Mr. Bossman. With Super Flea hidden away like a secret treasure, I go unburdened into battle. On first our thought, I think the real hard part about Psy level is that it's so long. There are many chances to die in making all the way to the end. Takes the luck of the Irish. Oh dear, an earthquake volcano, what man are of sorcery is this? You <laughs> crap, what a giant wizard man. You get blistered to the face, sir. And now you are dead, tee that was easy. Oh, now what a pain of it for earthquake. I'm shaking in my boots. Tear volcano exploded. And what's this? It seemed to be the wizard wand right form the ashes of lava. Well, you outright finally I can get my good friend Super Flea. Come on, buddy. Okay, I will tell him to wait here on the lava platform while I grab the magic wand weapon and climb the path of a narrow lava passage. This is very treacherous, Charney. You have to take little baby steps or fall off into a lava death. Trust me, you or I died many times falling into lava from the tricks in this level. Safety first, I always say. At the point here is some enemies. Don't use the list of here or the stupid kick of weapon will throw you down into lava. And that's not a fun time, let me tell you. You should use Silver Claw when possible to conserve ammo on this level. I only find one bundle of the list of logs up here, and I also get some lava rock weapons in this level, which used far the wizard Steve. Oh, and that wizard staff weapon is very good because he not much ammo on the large small screen he screwed you up. I guess that was one of those evil wizards. <laughs> yes, Einstein, it must be. You Thanks for your brilliant commentary. You idiot, you should be like me and make Don't good commentary it. of interesting facts and trivia. I show you how it's done. Okay, I'm in this room. Are many bats flying around? These guys are hard to kill with silver clock because flying so close ahead and use some of your precious ammo to take them out. Here I hate the horns of worms. I can never manage to kill those little guys before they poison me. Here is Lavrock weapons, which is most of the ammo available on this level. I don't like that weapon, so I just carry them in my pocket for now. But how does Zero handle the lab rocks without getting burnt? They must be some kind of magical lab rock created by the wizard, I guess. 
Of course this game need to have a great enemy, that is a classic enemy type. Okay, next checkpoint has many traps on the ceiling. Just stick to the walls and you will survive. There are square triggers on the floor to lower the spikes of death. Watch out! Spit on your door! They really threw a lot of fitter to them, they set you here. These guys must be mad that I killed Gear Wizard Bastar. And I killed them pretty heat. In the new sheriff in town of my worthless deputy super fleet. Scream and run away super guy. This is men's work not for your delicate constituent. At least he's mostly stay out of poor here. Although a few times in failed attempts of this level he did jump into lava, which was not cool. There are some jumps here that even the master acrobus Zadiker cannot pull off. But wait until you see these jumps. It's really pretty ridiculous. It's one thing, if it was to get you a secret, but you have to do crazy tricks just to finish the level. But here's such stick to the walls and you'll be fun. This trick is easy one. This is one of the longest levels so far. I will have to split this up deals into two videos. Once again, it's actually kind of fun of this level though. Maybe I just missed Dekatana. I was busy with some of our things so did not update, but now I am back and I make my move. Super guy come on watch me tear these guys at trap with my brutal weapons. Hell yeah, take that. Cal 60 play action over here. Super guy let's go once more into the breach for great justice. Poor baby, scared of that giant. I will take care of these guys like Brazil Princess Dunbury. Next I will show off Magis Lawn and we know and watch how it hurt me so much. It's a very powerful weapon but honestly I just wish there was more course you ammo so I wouldn't murder myself like this. Stupid man I obliterate you. Ouch. Damn it, destroying Mizro with this powerful magic! Oh, super guy, wait here, don't try these jumps. Fucking bullshit jumps right here. There are tiny ledges to jump to on rock walls, but they so small and it all looks the same with that rock texture. If you don't, tell Super Flint to wait he tried to make the jumps, but yeah right. Only a true master such as myself can do this, you idiot computer man. Just wait and I will do the hard work here. These ledges are so small, it's a tricky time of deed. Don't fall to a lot of death. Okay, phew, I made it now. That's the greatest part of the level. Now I can throw a floor to come over for Super Fleet to prance across like a beautiful ballerina. Come on little girl, your chariot awaits. He is so helpless in this episode, carrying a Kiko like that. This is like those escort missions in Wind Commander. Oh, by the way, I did finish Resident Evil 5. It really does remind me of the second episode with the Kiko of Dekatana. They copied. More random chests. The contents are different every time you play. So infinite replay value. Too bad I don't get Mega Shield this time. I really need some Reamer.